Okay. This is the upstairs indoor air handler. Here's the model and serial number right there. One year old. 20 by 20 by 1 air filter right here. The cover doesn't stay closed very well. It's stuck in air from the closet. Don't have a care and use manual. There's the electric service disconnect. Shallow P-trap. We don't have a secondary drain line. We've got a safety switch, a float switch. It also looks like they made some provisions here for one of those drain lines. Put the flashlight with no batteries. Provisions right there for a secondary drain line. Could have put one there, I'm supposing. It's interesting that the drain lines for the water heater, temperature, uh, not temperature, pressure relief valve, and secondary drain. Is that a secondary drain? Yeah, that's a condensate drain, high efficiency condensate drain. This guy's supposed to have a filter on him. Actually, it's kind of big. But one's supposed to have a filter. Interesting. Up here, yeast manual for the furnace, for the heater, indoor air handler, or this. You see that little red gas tag up there? It says gas. They're supposed to take that off to adjust the port so that it operates efficiently. So right now they just bolted it up. It probably runs just fine the way it is just bolted up. But you know that nobody ever fine tuned the gas ports on this thing when they installed it. But you still got that tag. There's a the thermostat right there. Oh, and by the way, we're in the closet off of the largest balcony. Oh, that's interesting. On the fourth floor. So we come out here. Uh, we got a shallow P trap for the indoor air handler, no insulation. And then again, the gas wasn't adjusted right. The secondary drain line. Let me see if I can get some instructions around here. Maybe I can find them in the kitchen. But if that's for condensate, because it's such a high efficiency gas heater, then it should have a neutralizing filter on it. That's what I'm thinking. And I reserve the right to be wrong. I reserve the right to change my mind. But this is a good idea right here. See these connections on this PEX? Those aren't the brass ones. There was some problems with PEX, class action lawsuit, la da 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 da. And I believe it was the brass couplings that was giving everybody the grief. So these have been updated since then and are probably fine. And then. Because we can't stay on such. I wouldn't do that to you. Check out the rain gutter here. The downspout. It just shoots past the rain gutter. Just right onto the street below. It's like, like a storm. Interesting. Interesting choice. 